Welcome everyone. Today I'll be making a number plate from the movie Back to the Future. This is the number plate that was on the DeLorean for those of you who don't know. I'm making this for a guy called Dave Jones from the EEV blog. He has a YouTube channel and he's based in Australia. So please check out his channel. I'll be putting the link in the description below. I will now go through all the steps involved in making the plate. The machine starts by V-bit engraving out the outer time first. I normally have a dust chute to extract all the dust, however, I leave this all for filming so that everyone can see exactly how the engraving is done. Afterwards, I mask some of the material that I don't want to be painted. I just use the standard can of blue spray paint to paint the outer time part. And there's a fly walking around. This is hard to avoid due to the fact that I live in Africa. Well, South Africa. Now it's time for a tool train, because I need to find a bit to engrave the California part of the plate. This is my DIY Auto Tool Zero. I use this to re-zero the Z axis after I've done a tool change. After the California part of the number plate is engraved, I will mask it again and paint it again, obviously in a different color. And lastly, I engrave the sun part of the California number plate. After all that is done, I do a simple profile cut. I do this so that I'm able to get it out of the material. And now it's time to head over to the belt sander, where I'll sand the face of the plate until all the unwanted paint is removed. Now with all the excess paint removed, we end up with a clean surface to apply the final coat of white paint. Thank you so much for watching, I really hope that Dave enjoys his number plate, and I'm hoping to get this to him before the 21st of October, because that is the day that Marty McFly arrives.